the collaboration of faith, an exploration into the likely interpretation on the biblical story of the binding of Isaac by the teachings of Charles Fillmore, Neville Goddard, and Reverend Ike. Hello my sweet God candies and welcome to this special video in which we explore the profound teachings of three remarkable spiritual teachers, Charles Fillmore, Neville Goddard, and Reverend Ike. Today, we delve into the story of Abraham and the Binding of Isaac, a powerful biblical tale that carries timeless lessons about faith, surrender, and the manifestation of our desires. By merging the insights of Fillmore, Goddard, and Reverend Ike, we embark on a journey of spiritual understanding and transformation. You will also get to practice these teachings with a seven-step mental exercise and assimilate them with 25 affirmations. I highly recommend taking notes. Part 1. Charles Fillmore's Perspective Charles Fillmore, the co-founder of the Unity School of Christianity, believed in the creative power of our thoughts and the importance of aligning our consciousness with divine principles. In the story of Abraham and the binding of Isaac, Fillmore would emphasize the significance of Abraham's unwavering faith and willingness to surrender his beloved son as a demonstration of absolute trust in God's guidance. Fillmore would stress that just as Abraham placed his faith in the divine, we too must develop unwavering trust in the spiritual laws that govern our lives. Abraham's act of surrender symbolizes our ability to release attachment to the outcome and surrender to the highest good. Through this surrender, we create space for divine miracles to manifest in our lives. Part 2 – Neville Goddard's Perspective Neville Goddard, a prominent teacher of new thought and visualization techniques, would provide his unique perspective on the story of Abraham and the binding of Isaac. Goddard would highlight the transformative power of imagination and the role it plays in the manifestation of our desires. According to Goddard, Abraham represents the power of imagination, while Isaac symbolizes our desires and aspirations. The binding of Isaac signifies the act of focusing our attention solely on our desired outcome. Goddard would encourage us to vividly imagine the fulfillment of our desires, feeling the emotions associated with their accomplishment. In Goddard's teachings, the story teaches us that as we faithfully persist in our imaginal acts, we bring our desires into physical reality. Our unwavering conviction and the ability to live from the end result create a vibrational alignment with our desires, allowing them to materialize. Part 3 – Reverend Ike's Perspective Reverend Ike, known for his teachings on prosperity consciousness and the power of the spoken word, would offer his dynamic perspective on the story of Abraham and Isaac. Reverend Ike would emphasize the importance of affirmations and the creative power of our words. To Reverend Ike, Abraham symbolizes our faith, while Isaac represents, among other things, our wealth and abundance. The binding of Isaac signifies our commitment to using affirmative and empowering language to affirm our desired prosperity. Reverend Ike would encourage us to declare affirmations such as I am prosperous, I am abundant, and I am the creator of my own reality. In Reverend Ike's teachings, thoughts become things. The story of Isaac could teach us that by being bold in our thoughts and by believing in ourselves, we actualize our desires into existence, 
we activate the power of the spoken word and align ourselves with the limitless abundance of the universe. Our words become creative forces that attract prosperity and blessings into our lives. In this collaborative lecture on the story of Abraham and the binding of Isaac, we have witnessed the synergistic wisdom of Charles Fillmore, Neville Goddard, and Reverend Ike. Through Fillmore's focus on faith and surrender, Goddard's emphasis on imagination and visualization, and Reverend Ike's teachings that thoughts become things, we gain a comprehensive understanding of the story's profound teachings. Here's your mental exercise inspired by age-old teachings on imagination for manifesting desires. Step 1. Find a quiet and comfortable space where you can relax and focus without distractions. Take a few deep breaths to center yourself and let go of any tension or stress. Step 2. Close your eyes and bring to mind a specific desire that you would like to manifest. It could be related to any aspect of your life, such as relationships, career, health, or abundance. Choose something that feels exciting and meaningful to you. Step 3. Begin to imagine that your desire has already been fulfilled. Create a vivid mental picture of yourself in a specific scene or situation that represents the fulfillment of your desire. See yourself fully experiencing and enjoying the desired outcome. Step 4. Engage all your senses in this visualization exercise. What do you see in this scene? Notice the colors, shapes, and details. What do you hear? Pay attention to any sounds, voices, or music. What do you feel? Experience the emotions, sensations, and textures associated with the fulfillment of your desire. What do you smell and taste? Imagine any scents or flavors that enhance this experience. Step 5 Immerse yourself fully in this visualization, feeling as if it is happening right now. Allow yourself to experience a profound sense of gratitude and joy for the fulfillment of your desire. Let the emotions and sensations wash over you, amplifying your belief that this desire is your reality. Step 6. Repeat this visualization exercise regularly ideally once or twice a day. Each time you engage in this mental imagery, bring even more detail, clarity, and intensity to your visualization. Feel the emotions deeply and believe wholeheartedly in the reality of your desire. Step 7. As you go about your daily life, Maintain an attitude of expectancy and trust that your desire is manifesting. Let go of any doubts, worries, or attachments to the outcome. Embrace a state of faith and certainty, knowing that the universe is conspiring to bring your desire into fruition. Remember, consistency and belief are key. The more you practice this exercise and truly immerse yourself in the feeling of having your desire already fulfilled, the more you align your consciousness with the manifestation of that desire. Stay open to signs, synchronicities, and inspired action, as they may guide you towards the opportunities and resources necessary for the fulfillment of your desire. By engaging in this mental exercise of imagination regularly, you activate the creative power of your mind and align yourself with the abundant possibilities of the universe. Stay committed, persistent, and trust in the process of manifestation. May we all be inspired by Abraham's unwavering faith, his willingness to surrender, 
and his profound trust in the divine law. The story of the binding of Isaac serves as a powerful reminder that we too possess the ability to co-create our reality and manifest our desires through faith, imagination, and the power of our words. By combining the teachings of Charles Fillmore, Neville Goddard, and Reverend Ike, we are reminded that our thoughts, beliefs, and words hold immense creative power. When we align our consciousness with divine principles, vividly imagine our desired outcomes, and affirm our prosperity and abundance, we tap into the limitless possibilities available to us. Furthermore, the story of Abraham and the binding of Isaac teaches us the importance of surrendering attachment to the outcome and trusting in the higher wisdom of the universe. It encourages us to release fear, doubt, and limitations, and embrace a state of unwavering faith and confidence. As we integrate the teachings of Fillmore, Goddard, and Reverend Ike, we understand that our spiritual journey is a dynamic and multifaceted process. It encompasses the power of thought, the transformative ability of imagination, and the creative force of our thoughts and spoken words. By consciously applying these principles in our lives, we become active participants in the co-creation of our reality. In conclusion, the collaborative teachings of Charles Fillmore, Neville Goddard, and Reverend Ike shed light on the story of Abraham and the binding of Isaac in profound ways. Through faith, imagination, and the power of our words, we can manifest our desires, experience abundance, and align ourselves with the divine flow of the universe. May this synthesis of wisdom empower us to embrace our highest potential and live lives filled with love, joy, and infinite possibilities. Here are your very own 25 affirmations inspired by the teachings of Charles Fillmore, Neville Goddard, and Reverend Ike. Take a deep breath and let's begin. I am a powerful co-creator of my reality. My imagination is a gateway to manifesting my desires. I release all limiting beliefs and embrace my infinite potential. I trust in the divine guidance that leads me to my highest good. I am worthy of receiving all the abundance and blessings the universe has to offer. I vividly imagine and feel the fulfillment of my desires as if they are already manifested. I surrender my attachments and have unwavering faith in the divine timing of my manifestations. My thoughts and words are powerful creative forces that shape my reality. I am the author of my own story, and I choose to manifest a life of joy, love, and abundance. I align my consciousness with divine principles, allowing miracles to unfold in my life. I release fear and doubt and embrace the unlimited possibilities available to me. I am open and receptive to the signs and synchronicities that guide me towards my desires. I joyfully embrace the process of manifestation, knowing that every step brings me closer to my goals. 
I am grateful for the abundance that flows effortlessly into my life. I speak my desires into existence, affirming my prosperity and success. I am a magnet for positive opportunities, attracting them with my radiant energy. I trust that the universe conspires to bring my desires into fruition. I am worthy of love, happiness, and fulfillment in all areas of my life. I release any resistance and allow the natural flow of abundance to manifest in my life. I am in perfect harmony with the infinite intelligence of the universe. I deserve to experience and enjoy the manifestation of my dreams. I am surrounded by loving and supportive people who uplift and inspire me. I have unwavering faith in the power of my imagination to shape my reality. I am grateful for the lessons and growth that come with each step of my manifestation journey. I am a beacon of light, radiating love, abundance, and positivity into the world. Feel free to choose the affirmations that resonate most with you, or use them as inspiration to create your own personalized affirmations. Repeat them daily, preferably in a relaxed and focused state, and allow their positive vibrations to transform your beliefs and attract the manifestations you desire. Well, my sweet god candies, that's it for today. Thank you for listening. I hope you have benefited from this enlightening exploration. Please subscribe, hit the notification bell, like, comment and share with whoever you feel could benefit from age-old wisdom. And always remember that you are a sweet expression of God and that you deserve only the best.